part of the country then. What do you think, Jake? Are you dirty? These are the ruins of the old lumber mill. I don't know how old this is, but when we go around the bend, you can see like the river, and this is the middle of the woods. Thank you. Demonstrate like the price is right, girl. Solid? Good. <laughs> Actually, a pretty historical place, but no one seems to really come here. Care about it. I'm really not sure what all this is about. Someone has built like a little. I don't know that word. It's a little dam here to divert the water, I guess. It's unusually high. It's usually way, way, way lower. You can walk across most parts out here. There was one for jumping off a ropes, piece of rope into some dirty water with an undertow, but that is pretty cool. I saw the biggest water moccasin of my whole life, and I've seen a lot of them in this, this little pool that collects after a rain. Big water moccasin. I don't know if you can make it out, but the cypress knees, kind of unique.
love to come down here with like a little kayak or something. That was my plan. I was going to take sandbar. Yeah, you only need like a little cheap boat to get, get across. Yeah. One of them little inflatable rafts would probably do enough. A couple of paddles. They can swim across and pull it with a rope. This is the beach. If you walk back far enough, I mean, it's, it's pretty well untainted because no one comes back here. It's kind of a little bit of a hike. And it's very shallow here. You could just about walk across right here. This is probably the deepest part. It might get a couple feet deep. Thanks, Jack. 